So welcome once again ladies and gentlemen so um in this video i'll be showing you how to place trades okay so how to place trades now before you place any trade you must have a trading plan okay you need to understand what a trading plan is and how to make use of one so you you need the trading plan okay um how to analyze properly okay the fundamental the technical needs to be there do you understand the technical needs to be there observe a proper risk management you understand observe a proper risk management why because um with risk management you will be able to minimize your losses and make profit if you place six trades and you lose four that's if you are not good in trading and you lose four if you have a good risk management you can still be in overall profit i'll show an example in the group chat on how you can get that done okay do you understand so um let's fire away let's fire away we'll look at um something which is very very important now so how do you place a trade now for you to place a trade you can just simply um tap on any of them okay let's still use euro usd for some certain reason i love using euro usd as an example okay you open charts so you look at the chart okay now <clears throat> you can either predict it to go up which is buying or predict it to go down which is selling okay do you understand so um you will put stop loss as well as take profits as that will help you get a good result you understand so that you don't need to be with the trade while it is on so if you put a good um, stop loss and a good take profit you will not need to bother yourself about the trade at all all you need to do is just place it then go take a nap okay or just go do something else okay do you understand and once it hits your take profit the money will be into your account you understand it will come straight to your trading history and your balance will increase if you hit your stop loss that is if you are wrong you understand so which is why we put a stop loss a stop loss is meant to kick you out of the trade okay that is the job of a stop loss it is meant to kick you out of the trade if you are wrong so you will not lose too much money the stop loss will kick you out and you lose only small amounts but the take profit if you are right it will keep going until once you hit the take profit you will be able to cash in your money okay do you understand so let's forge ahead let's forge ahead now let's say we are placing a buy on this a sell on this trade okay what that simply means is that this is where it is where this red and blue line is that is where we are we are, that's the current price level that's the current price level so if you are predicting it to sell that is to go down in value so our take profit has to come down okay our take profit has to come down because we are predicting it to go down so if it goes down and let's say we want to put our take profit here and it hits here that simply means that um, money we are going to make money okay do you understand and if we predict it to go down and we are putting our take profit here we can decide to put our stop loss up here if eventually we are wrong and it's going up it's going to hit our stop loss and instead of it to keep going up and make us lose a lot of money once it gets here it's going to stop going up okay you understand so as you can see if we are correct our take profit will be much you, you can see the gap between the entry and the take profit and if we are wrong just a little amount is what we are going to lose in the stop loss position so that is just simply how you um place a trade and so let's let's go on and do that let's go on and do that so we can just simply get the value okay do you understand so the current level is um, 1.17158 okay that's the current price level that's the entry price okay you understand so where exactly are we going to put our stop loss like i said we are selling okay we are selling so if we are selling our stop loss will be above remember if we are selling we are predicting it to go down so our stop loss is going to be above the price level and our take profit will be below the price level okay so let's let's quickly set that so um let me show you what you will tap you can tap on this line here this line here okay you can tap on that um that cross sign rather once you tap on it it's going to bring out a line which you can draw down you know just use the line to locate where you want to put your um your take profit or your stop loss just you know draw it down somewhere like that and you get the exact value okay you get the exact value to be 1.16887 okay that is the value of where we want to put our take profit do you understand so um let's first of all quickly pl place a buy okay 1.16887 1.16887 okay so that is the position for our take profit so our stop loss can quickly sorry can quickly push this a bit up we want to put our stop loss at 
1.17238 so that is just simple stuff okay so let's quick quickly enter the cell if you want to place a trade this is where you will tap this plus sign here once you just tap it it's going to bring a window for you exactly market execution means you are market execution means you are does you want the trade to open immediately okay do you understand this is your lot size this is your lot size. Now, your risk management and your position size calculation will tell you the right lot size to use. If you use the wrong lot size, you will lose too much money or you might lose too much money, okay? So, make sure your lot size is as expected, please. Do you understand? So, let's go on. We are looking at using the right lot size here. So, um, let's change our... Let's leave our lot size at 1.0, okay? Let's quickly set our... Now, this red line is where you put stop loss. This green line is where you put take profits very very simple stuff okay you understand these values here are the current values the bid and ask value okay the bid and ask value that's the current um value of the currency okay so these are very very simple stuff so if we just simply go ahead okay um six minutes is gone i just i don't want to spend too much time on this video let's go ahead and edit it so we just tap on the plus on this icon here you understand or we just Tap what we want to type what we want to type. So our stop loss is what one one point sorry one point one seven two three eight. That's our stop loss. Our take profit is one point one six eight eight seven. Then we click a cell. Okay, you understand? We can then go ahead to click on this cell okay sell by market so once you click sell order is open so quickly we have the order open okay so you might be asking why is it starting from minus 24 dollars that's just the spread you understand you know the, the spread is 24 let me check yeah the spread is 24 so and our lot size is 1.0 so it will start with minus 24 dollars don't worry don't worry once your you you will quickly overcome it and it will go up to um profit okay so don't worry every trade we start that way if if we reduce 0 0.5 as the lot size that is half of this it will not be minus 24 it's going to be minus 12 yeah very very simple stuff so you don't need to worry yourself as long as you set you enter you do your analysis properly and you enter that um your trading value correctly you are good to go so um let's go back to the chart now we've already set our stop loss and take profit and we've sold the market so let's check the charts you can now see that the chart is saying sell 1.0 see our stop loss up here see our take profit down here very simple stuff okay so by moving by this alone we are now competent enough to say we've done a good job yeah guys so that is just basically how to place a trade okay you understand so um if you want to see the trade you tap here okay so let's tap on it okay you understand if you want to close a trade you hold the trade down and push it to the left sorry yeah you, you you can still hold it down and um, choose close order new order modify order probably you want to edit the the position of the stop loss and take profit then chart okay then understand. so you can just tap on close order so as you can see is no longer minus 24 is minus 23 so as we are going more towards where we want to um where we want to where we are predicting towards is going to enter profit okay so um now this is where you tap for history like i said this down please like i said this is simply a new account that i created just for the sake of this class so there is no trade that has been placed on it so but let's just tap tap there so once you tap on it some trades will be so for those of you who have seen my the the um trading results i shared on the group chat i got it from my history okay this was the part i tapped this place you understand and it showed both my profit my loss but there was no loss okay so some of you if you have actually gone through the group so you must have seen what i made and, and i will send more for you what i've been making you know, over the weeks and the like so trading is very very simple guys very very simple so with risk management we are good to go do you understand with risk management we are good to go okay so i would have done another example but i believe we get it so um and, 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 and i don't want to make this video too long i don't want to make it too long so if eventually you 
um, don't get it, you can still go through it again. And, and with this, I believe you can place trades and place trades well, okay? So before you go about placing trades, like I said earlier, make sure you have, you've done your analysis properly, you've, um, you've actually um, have a trading plan already, and you observe a proper risk management, okay? You understand? Risk management will tell you the right slot size, the, the right position to put your stop loss, your take profits. You understand? So, so that you will be in profit at the end of the trade, okay? So thank you so much.